Hey there, welcome to the Doctor Who Guide, the community where it's all about helping you grow your knowledge, collection, and connection with other Doctor Who fans. I'm your host, Alex Patterson, and today's video is a tabletop review, and I am super excited to tackle Doctor Who, the collection, season 23. We're going to be taking a closer look at this and seeing what the design of the set looks like. And I also have the U.S. Complete Colin Baker Season 2. And we're going to be taking a closer look at the design of this as well. And then in a third video, we will be comparing both of these side by side so that you know what you're getting with each set. And I'm super excited to take a closer look at both of these beautiful sets today on the Doctor Who Guide. <laughs> The best box set that you can buy for Doctor Who. Hey, welcome back to this tabletop review. I'm super excited to have this beautiful box set in my collection sent to me by the wonderful Robert Hill from Australia. If you haven't seen that unboxing video, you should definitely check it out because uh, he sent a lot of other lovely goodies as well as this set. Now, it's still in its wrapping at this point, so I'm going to open this up and then we can take a close look at what beautiful things are in store. All right, so that's the plastic off. We'll get rid of that and take a look at this. Oh my gosh. Now, the first thing you can note about the sets is not only the beautiful artwork by Lee Binding, we'll get to that in a second, but these box sets come with slip cases. <gasps> oh my gosh, we'll look at that in a second. So the front and these two sides are go only about 20% of the way up the full slip case in the back is the only side where we have a full slipcase on the outside. So the artwork here is the same as what we'll see on the front cover, but this has the lettering of the BBC, the Doctor Who logo there, and the collection season 23, as well as the ratings. So the artwork that we're gonna see in a second will be just the clean artwork, uh, which looks lovely, but this is what identifies it as season 23 and has the logo. This is what it says on the side, season 23, with the 12 rating and the BBC logo. That is the same as the other side. This is what the bottom of the set looks like. You have the rating and some legal information here, the ISBN number, and then this little awesome bit of artwork. Like, oh my gosh, look at that. That is amazing. And we have the information at the bottom, starring Colin Baker and Nicola Bryant with Bonnie Langford. And it tells you uh, how each disc features uh, ex all of the extensive special features previously released on DVD, including making up documentaries, featurettes, deleted scenes, audio commentaries, info text, and much more. To my knowledge, everything comes along from the DVD releases, except for the occasional bonus feature that might fit better on another season set. And uh, I'm not sure if all of the Easter eggs come along. So. Then we have a list of all the new features that are on this box set, and I'm so excited. Uh, extended edits of every episode, that's so cool. A standalone special edition for Terror of the Vervoids, 5.1 surround sound and isolated scores on all 14 episodes. New behind the sofas, which I love. The writer's room, talking to the people who wrote and this season and made it what it was. You've got the cookbook revisited, which is gonna be really cool. I think that's gonna be a really unique bonus feature and that's really fun and then the doctor's table where you can join Colin Baker and friends for dinner you've got Matthew Sweet interviewing Bonnie Langford so that's really cool um, I can't wait to see Matthew Sweet uh, interview Nicola Bryant as well unseen studio footage rare archive discoveries blu-ray trailer which was really really fun and then tons of pdf materials and then you have this wonderful beautiful artwork of the sixth doctor on trial i mean i just want to give a shout out to lee binding for the incredible artwork done here you see perry bald and on the surgery table and the sixth doctor just looking uh, guilty and, and sad and worried and confused and it's got the valyard just i mean how do you create this artwork it's amazing you've got the valyard and the inquisitor in the background there all right so that's just the slip cover we can set that aside and take a look at the set now this is just Beautiful, beautiful artwork. I just love the Sixth Doctor's regal pose here and the incredible artwork that Lee Binding has done. So here we have the Sixth Doctor looking just absolutely awesome. He's not like super happy, but he's not super grumpy. And I think that describes the Sixth Doctor pretty well. You've got the continued galaxy design in the background. You've got him in his wonderful, colorful outfit. And then we have, of course, villains and characters from the series. Let's dive into this. So up here we have a Vervoid. 
and then next to that verb void is the valyard pointing accusingly and we can see even the cat pin on the doctor's coat like that is so epic and we have of course here this robot from uh, the mysterious planet i forget what they're called please comment down below you have sill oh my gosh sill is back then the tardis coming into the station there and then you have this interesting little detail of the doctor holding some sort of a note and it's got names on it and uh, i don't know i don't think you can tell what they say but it's so cool to have such an amazing little detail on this set. So that's the front. Let's take a look at the side. Here we see it says Doctor Who The Collection Season 23, and you've got the code number for this product. You have the same thing on the top side here, and then nothing on the bottom side. This is what you get on the binding. You have, you have incredibly detailed artwork of the front, but just as a miniature square on the side, which looks so cool, lined up with all the other sets. You have the Blu-ray logo at the top, and then you have the BBC Doctor Who, the collection logo just there, and then season 23 on the side, and BBC at the bottom. Now we can take a look at this incredible artwork on the back. This is the incredible station that you see the TARDIS is getting just yanked right into. That's so amazing. You've got the stars and galaxy in the background. Let's zoom in closer. So there's the very tip of the station. And as you go down, we get to see more of it. And it is just so incredible. We can see such incredible design in this set. It looks amazing. Like, ah, oh, how do you create such beautiful art? I don't, I don't know. And there's the TARDIS being sucked right in there. And oh my gosh, this is just so beautiful. Like how amazing is that? Ah, oh, I love it so much. Ah, oh, the galaxy in the background too just looks amazing. So, so that is the artwork. Let's see what's inside. Oh my gosh. Okay, we'll get to the discs in a second. Let's look at this little booklet holder. Oh my gosh. So here we have the TARDIS, oh my gosh, landed with a sixth doctor right there in the ocean. That's so amazing, that water and the pink ocean, accurate to the episode. Just such a beautiful image right here. The detail is just so amazing with the sixth doctor there and then the water, oh my gosh. And I love, I love this. I love that the TARDIS doors once again, line up with how you open up the book. There's a little Velcro button that you use to open up these flaps and look inside here. Oh my gosh. So look, we have another awesome piece of artwork, which we saw on the back of the slipcase. Now we get to see it full sized. Oh my gosh, such an amazing moment from this trial. And you can just see in the doctor's face, like he doesn't remember these bad things happening. And that's just like, Oh, that's season 23 in a nutshell. And uh, although the uh, these flaps don't line up uh, completely, which uh, I suppose is better than the season 19 set where they overlapped and chopped off Adric's nose. So, uh, but if you, I suppose, if you place the booklet properly, you could close that gap. All right, so these flaps inside then open up to reveal the booklet inside with the same artwork. We'll get to that in a second. But here we have once again, a TARDIS console room display. Oh my gosh, uh, the this flap is just sort of gray with some light on it. And this flap down here is also gray. But inside here, you have your own little display case. And of course, the TARDIS console there looking spectacular. You see something on the screen there. I don't know if that's something that we can make out as anything really, but then you also have this, like the exercise bike that the sixth doctor uses. Oh, that's, that's amazing. And then you have in the, on the scanner passing ship. So that is so cool. That's just the kind of details that blow my mind uh, with, with these incredible sets. So I'll just push that off to the side. Now we can take a look at the booklet. So here we once again have the same artwork that we saw on the booklet holder and on the slipcase. On the inside here, we've got this picture of Colin Baker 
and a quote from him, bittersweet memories. It says, welcome to season 23, Doctor Who on trial. Both the story was about the Doctor being on trial, but the show at this time was also on trial. So it'll be like fascinating to hear about what that time was like. These are the descriptions of what are on disc one and it talks about the development of each story. You get pictures from the story. You have the Valyard just there. And then we get these lovely little bits of artwork that I just absolutely adore. Like I can't look at that. I just can't believe it. He looks, the doctor looks like he's in quite a pickle there. Oh my word. So this is the page with that artwork there. We've got lovely pictures of the cast from season 23. We've got a picture of the Valyard and the doctor there. We have the information as to what's on disc two here. Another picture of Yarkonos. Got the Inquisitor. We've got uh, that other member of Sil species. You've got this lovely piece of artwork with the Sixth Doctor and the TARDIS in the background and then Sil, Yarkonos, and Perry there. This feels like you get your own little magazine to go along with a set. Oh my gosh. And then you can see that you've got Jamie, Adric, and Turlo also reacting to this series. That makes me so excited to see the behind the scene, behind the sofa segments. Oh my gosh, that's just perfect. And you've got a Vervoid there. We've got some Vervoid and Mel artwork, which is just beautiful. Oh my gosh, I love it. You've got the Sixth Doctor and Mel there. Oh my gosh, that's really, really fun. You've got these two guys who you see on a lot of the artwork for Terror of the Vervoids. This is kind of a base under siege story, which makes it really fun. Final disc description. You've got Matthew Sweet and Bonnie Langford there. Oh my gosh, picture from their interview. That's really cool. You've got, oh my gosh, more artwork. That is amazing. <gasps> You have the Valyard there, the Sixth Doctor and Savalom Glitz, and then all oh, those hands just pulling them under. That is so creepy. Oh my gosh, I love it. And then you've got the Sixth Doctor being pulled under there, and the Valyard as well. And oh my gosh, oh, that's a classic picture right there. Oh my gosh. And you've got Bonnie Langford and Anthony Ainley as the Master. Oh my gosh, one of his final appearances as the Master. We have the bonus discs. This is going to be really fun to explore these discs and everything that's on them. Oh my gosh. There's India Fisher with Doctor Who the Cookbook. Oh my gosh. This looks like so much fun. The Doctor's Table. And then you have the credits here. Well, well done to everybody who put together this set and this booklet. And you have this lovely picture of Colin Baker on the back. Oh my gosh. And we haven't even gotten to the discs yet. So... We'll take this booklet, put it back inside, close this up, close that up, close this up. There we go. And then we can move on to the discs. Now the discs come out in a way that's not always easy. Uh, really, I would suggest tipping them out because you don't really have room to get your fingers in the side there. Uh, and they open up in this sort of storybook format is what I call it, but it's a digi pack. Uh, format that you can flip through. So I'm going to straighten these out and then we'll take a closer look. So here we have the first disc. This is disc one, Trial of the Time Lord, episodes one to four, and uh, the story title is The Mysterious Planet. You have the sixth doctor looking around at his surroundings and uh, a bit confused, but that's all just part of this tale. And then we have Trial of the Time Lord episodes 5 to 8, Mind Warp, and we, have, and we have an operation going on, a surgery, and the Doctor looking worried about it. Then we have the Trial of the Time Lord episodes 9 to 12, Terror of the Vervoids. Oh, hi there. You've got one Vervoid who is hatched out of its cocoon, and then three more cocoons in the background there. I was hoping to see Mel or Perry on one of these discs so far, but not quite yet. I know this actor from Keeping Up Appearances, and it's fun to see that uh, Richard from Keeping Up Appearances was in both Revelation of the Daleks and Voyage of the Damned, but also in the next season, we will see uh, Daisy from Keeping Up Appearances in uh, Paradise Towers as well. So it, seemed, it feels like everybody but Hyacinth has been in Doctor Who so far. Anyway, 
that is cool artwork as well. This is disc four, The Trial of a Time Lord, episodes one to 13, The Ultimate Foe. And then we have the bonus disc one with the incredible Inquisitor there with the Valyard in the background, and some even some other Time Lords there. Like that detail is just amazing. This is bonus disc one, disc five of the entire set. And then this is bonus disc two, disc six of the entire set. And we have, of course, the Sixth Doctor looking impressive there with the TARDIS in the background. That is so cool. Now, the awesome, there's one more awesome surprise, which is if you take out this disc, we see the Sixth Doctor, oh my gosh, from his theme, looking absolutely incredible. I love that each season has this little snapshot in the background. That is so cool. So obviously, this entire set is just chock full of amazing artwork so many features you've got your own little magazine booklet there amazing artwork by lee binding wonderful job congratulations i absolutely adore this artwork you can keep this house safely in its slipcase here and there we go that's the season 23 uk set that's the design i hope to do a video in the future breaking down everything that's on these discs but for now this has been the artwork. If you want to see my review of the US set, what that looks like, and my comparison of both of these sets side by side, then you can find those videos linked in the blog post down below. Thanks so much for watching. Leave a comment with your thoughts on this set, whether you have it, whether you don't have it, and what your thoughts are on season 23. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!